Gambler and Lewis have got Equifest coming up in a few days. So today we're just gonna go through on how to tidy up his tail for the show ring. I always like to do it a couple of days a week, at least before big shows, just so it's as tidy as can be. And then I've got a few days if I find stray hairs that I don't like how they're sitting, that I can tidy it up as we go. So now we've crushed through the tail. It's not too badly outgrown, but it definitely needs to tidy up. All we want is a sharp pair of scissors, a, a brush and a tail rake. I think this is medium rake. Um, if I find the link, I will tag it down below. But so we just start on the top. So what we're trying to aim for here, here is it to go shaped here down to like his bum cheeks so it accentuates the bum cheeks a bit more so we've got to get rid of all this bit you don't want a clean tail it's too slippy this glides through it too quick too easily so we want it pretty dirty but brushed through so what we do is go down to the side and we rake down and we take off all the excess that comes off so under the tail, break down. Always be careful with your horse, make sure they don't kick out, stand to the side. I know gamblers are okay with this being done. But as I say, pull out everything that comes. See, we're just taking off the long ends. And as you can see already, we've got such a nice, neater side to that side than we have this side. So it doesn't take long to do. Just get it nicely. I always do it about a third of the way down my tail, just by the bottom of his bum cheeks. And if you're not sure how your horse will react, react to it, do a bit one side, then a bit the other, so they're even as you go. I know Gambler's fine with it, so I'll do one side and then move on to the next. As you can see, that side is a lot neater already. A lot more, if you could look from behind, Lewis. You can see that it's nicely shaped into his bum cheek. He's holding it out a little bit <laughs> because we're here. But once he sits it down a bit more, it's shaped. So we're, then we go on to this side and sort this bit out. Look at the floor. Look how much has come out of it already just to get that one shape. So now we move to this side. And again, we pull the hair from the back of the tail through. got a kinky bit here that seems to stick out more so just trying to shape that bit for him boy
I'm happy with that bit. He doesn't have much hair on the front because as I say, it wasn't long ago that he was done, but we just take your rake just down the front, just to smooth it out slightly. But as I say, he hasn't got much on the front anyway, so I don't want to take too much off of that for him. If you like what you see, then please boop the like button. We've got a week to Equifest, so I can tidy up any loose ends that I find within this week. But now we've tidied the tail. If you come around the side, Lewis. As he lifts his tail up as he's trotting round, there's no loose hairs underneath. There's one bit I'll get, but there's no loose hairs if he lifts his tail in the show ring. So then we go on to the bottom. That's where let me brush, just brush this bit through again. And you want a sharp pair of scissors. What you want from the tail is, once it's shaped, it will come from just above the hocks and go down to a point. So we want to get rid of this bit. This bit, basically. So in the Welsh world, when they flag their tail up, it will be a diamond shape at the bottom. We want to take out, we want to shape it and take out some weight. As I say, Gambler's wasn't long done, so there's not too much weight in there, but we need to get the shape now. I've done this for a few years, so I know what I want to take off. So if you're doing it to your horse, I would do little bits often, so you don't take too much off. But so as I say, we want to start from the hock and work your way down. to the point but so we do it from the hock so it accentuates the judge can see their hock more in the show ring start with taking little bits off but you can see the shape of that is already coming So often, give it a brush through. So you can see where the hair sits. So now I've got a long bit here. We don't want it dead straight. We want it to look natural. And as you do these sides, it will take some length off the bottom. You are not allowed to bang, what they call bang horses, Welsh's tails, where you do just a straight line at the bottom. It's not allowed on the Welsh's. So I'm pretty happy with that. It's just a few stray hairs, and as I say, I always do it a few days before the show. So once it's had a bath, been turned out or anything, when the hair sits differently, I can then go and take little bits off of it. Okay. 
think I'm uh, pretty happy with that. Just take a little bit more off the bottom. For the length, but by doing that, I go down these sides to my point at the bottom. 